Hi everyone, my name is Rose and this is Adam App. What are we learning about today, Adam App? Today, we are going to investigate different types of coins and talk about their values. There are eight different sized coins used in the UK. They have two sides. This side of the coin is called heads. It shows the head of the king or the queen and the date that the coin was made. This side is called tails, and on most coins, the coin's value is written in words. Coins can be bronze, silver, or silver and gold in color. The color helps to show their value. Bronze coins are worth the least, silver coins are in the middle, and gold and silver coins are worth the most. Bronze and silver coin values are measured in pence. Gold and silver coin values are measured in pounds. Let's look at each of the coins in a bit more detail. Here are the bronze coins. They are round. The smallest bronze coin is worth one pence, and the larger bronze coin is worth two pence. One two pence coin has the same value as two one p coins. Here are the five pence and ten pence coins. They are both silver and they are both round. The five pence coin is much smaller than the ten pence coin. It is the smallest coin of all. Two five pence coins has the same value as one ten pence coin. Here are the twenty pence and fifty pence coins. These coins are both silver and both have seven straight edges. The twenty pence coin is much smaller than the fifty pence coin. Two ten pence coins have the same value as one twenty pence coin. Finally, here are the one pound and two pound coins. They are both silver and gold in color. The one pound coin has twelve straight edges and is much smaller than the two pound coin. The one pound coin has a picture of a crown, a thistle, a rose. A leek and a shamrock on its tail side. The two-pound coin is the largest coin of all. It's round and it has a pattern on its tail. Two one-pound coins have the same value as one two-pound coin. For the next activity, you will need a sock, a one-pence coin, a two-pence coin, a five-pence coin, a ten-pence coin, a twenty-pence coin, a fifty-pence coin, a one-pound coin. And a two-pound coin. Place the coins in the sock like this. Then close your eyes and put one hand inside the sock. Try to identify the coin before you pull it out of the sock, and see how many guesses that you get correct. Now it's your turn to try this game. Pause the video here and have a go. Welcome back. How did you get on? It sounds like you have been very busy. Did you manage to identify the coins left on screen? Well done if you did. They were a two pound, a one pence, and a fifty pence coin. For an extra challenge, why not use your set of coins to make some coin rubbings? Place each coin under a piece of paper and gently rub a crayon over the top. Thanks for watching and keep practicing because practice makes permanent. See you next time. If you enjoyed this concept video, make sure you head over to our landing page, where you'll find videos from fully qualified teachers about English, maths, and a whole range of foundation subjects. Twingle concepts, concepts made clear.